life. So we bring our friend back in here. So there he is. Um, so first thing is anatomical position. What is an anatomical position? Okay. You gotta grab the glands, the head, not the foreskin. If you're not circumcised, if you grab your foreskin, you pull you pull forward, what happened? That head's gonna go back and you're gonna stick your needle into the side of the penis, and you think it's the side of the penis, you're sticking it right into the head of the penis. So you want to grab the penis and pull it straight out, anatomical position, okay? Don't turn it, because you turn it like this, now what happens? You're skewing the anatomy. Now all of a sudden you're gonna stick your needle into the urethra or you're gonna stick the needle into the neurovascular bundle. So straight out, all right? Once you got it straight out, you want to first look at your danger zones. What are we talking about danger zones? So the parts of the danger zones are the 12 o'clock position, which is this part right up here, right there. And of course the six o'clock position, which is the bottom part right here, all right? Why is that the danger zone? Because that's the urethra and the neurovascular bundle. Really, you want to come along the sides, all right? So you want to do, this is, they talk and they say is a three o'clock position, or three or two o'clock, or over here, which is a nine or 10 o'clock position, okay? So you want to come right along the side and inject, boom, boom, boom. You don't want to skive like this. You want to go straight and perpendicular. This is about nine o'clock, this is about 10 o'clock. This is over here, again, about three o'clock, and this is about two o'clock. Straight in. You can go anywhere along the shaft of the penis, never the glands, but most guys will be close to the base. And you want to spread the love, never inject in the exact same place every single time. You want to stick the needle right in, boom. Don't want to don't want to just little button up the whole thing in because if you don't push it all the way in, you're not going to get into the corporate. That's the key. Once you're in, you give it a good push, take it out. After you're done, you hold a little pressure there with your finger, maybe two, three, four minutes. And that hopefully then will prevent the hematoma, which again is very rare. Uh, but you want to be careful with those superficial veins. Those superficial veins can bleed. Not going to cause permanent damage, but your penis will look like an eggplant for about seven to ten days. It'll go away. It'll get better. 